Can you describe what went through your mind when you blocked Kareem's shot? Uh, I tried to, but um, I saw him coming to the basket. Actually, Moses Malone was guarding him. I was on Jimmy Jones, and he came my way. And I said, this is the time. And I just went up off of two feet, jumped high as I could, and I timed it perfect. And uh, playing defense was just exciting and scoring points. And it changed the dynamic of the game. And we went on to win the, that game and also the series. And I remember after I did it, Kareem told me, uh, good, good block, young fella. And I said, thank you. And um, it was very special in my life. And I remember when I went to the bench that uh, Rudy Tom Donald said he saw a flash and they got a picture of it. And I do have a picture of it today. Who, in your opinion, should be the top five Rucker Park basketball players of all time? Oh, uh, Fly Williams, Pee Wee Kirkland, um, Joe Hammond, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, and Connie Hawk. That's an amazing starting five. That's like unstoppable. Um, what was your most memorable moment at Rucker Park? Uh, just playing, winning the championship, the camaraderie I had with my teammates, and coming from New Jersey two or three times a week. It was an experience for me, and I never got tired of talking about the games that I played in, the people that I met. and. Um, Till this day, when I talk about it, I just get so excited about basketball. And um, after I did my schoolwork, I always went to Rucker. And the memories I had was just things that I never saw before in my life, even in the NBA. The, the moves were never duplicated. And all the great players do not make the NBA. Rucker Park had the greatest players that ever laced it up sneakers or touched the basketball. And this will always be forever. What does it mean to you to be here at this event today? Oh, the 50th anniversary of the Rucker is one of the most important things in my life. I was coming over to New York since I was 15 and to see these players, players that I've known, played against, and also watched at a young age, just to hear them talk about their memories and living in New York and playing in Rucker Park is something that I remember and be able to tell my kids and grandkids one day. And that park will always be there, 155th Street, 8th Avenue, and Harlem. So uh, it's a very special time in my life to be here and um, participate in this 50th anniversary of the Rucker Tournament. Thanks again, Bill. For more interviews, make sure to check, to check out NBA Brothers and don't forget to follow us on Twitter and Instagram at, at NBA, NBA Brothers. Brothers.